David Smith, and welcome to Correctional Officer Lifestyle. Evening, folks. Welcome to Correctional Officer Lifestyle. This is David M. Smith. So, this is a end of the week wrap up video. So, I'm going to start with Saturday, and I'm going to work my way through until the end of the week. So, I've said so three times because I'm tired. It, it is what it is. Okay. Started off the week. I worked Saturday. And I was off Sunday. I took Sunday off simply because I needed a break. I had worked three weekends in a row and I just needed a break. Um, Monday and Tuesday. Got some pretty good workouts in. Uh, well, Sunday and Monday I got some workouts in. One of them I put online. Tuesday I did next to nothing as far as working out goes. I loaded up a couple of cars and I took them to the junk scrap yard for my for my dad. And he was he was very happy. He was very pleased. Um, I was able to help him out. That means a lot. So Wednesday and Thursday I go back to work and I get told that I'm at the work camp. So yay, I'm at the work camp. I like being at the work camp with one problem. There's only one problem at the work camp, and it's a, it's a rather serious problem at the work camp. It's boring at the work camp. Nothing happens down there. Uh, everybody that says something does happen is a liar, or they've never worked at the main unit, or they ain't worked at the main unit so long they forgot what it, you know, what really happens. So it is what it is. I worked two days down there within the first two hours. I had gotten all of my past RMS that I had messed up on and everything else that I had put off until a later date done. And had 22 hours over two days to fuss and fight and try to get everything right. It is what it is. Yesterday, I did probably next to nothing. Today, I tried a word-working project. My wife thinks it's cute. I don't think it turned out the way I wanted it to. I'm going to tweak it, see if I can make it better. I've got videos. Um, I didn't start with measuring and the cutting. I actually started with sanding the legs. Because I, I've i never recorded myself working, woodworking stuff before. But I'll post it online. We'll see what happens. But today, we got Spectrum Internet Service hooked up and running like it's supposed to be and we're going to try to upload this video on the spectrum and hopefully it is as much faster as I want it to be that being said folks that's about all I got for this video this is the weekly wrap up um, still working on getting the studio right I did record a song in there and I'll put that online later as well it's on the it's on the GoPro so but Love shouldn't hurt, people. Love shouldn't hurt. If you're in an abusive relationship, please find a way out of it. If you know somebody in an abusive relationship, help them out. If you know the abuser in an abusive relationship, remember the worst thing you can say. The worst thing you can do is nothing. Say something to somebody. And if you are the abuser in an abusive relationship, there's help for you too. First thing you've got to do, though, is you have to admit that you need that help. That's all I got for this one, folks. If you like what you see, hit the like button. If you want to leave me some feedback, hit me in the comments. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. And make sure you hit that bell for notification when I post new videos. This is David Smith, Correctional Officer Lifestyle. I'll see you on the next video.